this uh, apartment here is where my brother-in-law lived at, but he's in a wheelchair. He was real lucky because uh, he, he couldn't move around. This is the apartment he lived in. And you see what went through the, through the house. Severe damage to a senior home in Leechville, leaving many of the residents with no place to go. Mature living apartments in Leechville was a place many seniors called home. And Friday night's tornadoes are unforgettable for some. Carice Clements reports. Only one bright light shines as others flicker while crews work to restore power to Leechville. The work site nearly steps away from mature living apartments, memories left from those who live there. Brothers Leo and Dean Clayton called this place home. This was my hometown. I've lived here ever since I was 12 years old. I'm 84 now. An experience like none other, they nearly lost everything. By the time I got to the bathroom, my whole apartment was just shaking. I mean, you know, it tore, it tore up everything around here. Minutes that seemed to last much longer left them lost for words. I was so scared, I don't really know how I feel. Cars totaled and apartment glasses shattered as they tried to piece together their lives. Through the losses, they remained thankful things were not worse. I just ask God to be protected, so, you know, be, you know, be merciful on this, and he, you know, he was, because it could have been a lot worse than it is. In Leechville, Carice Clemens, Region 8 News. All residents of mature living apartments have been relocated. We reached out to the manager of the apartments and there was no response. Donations such as toiletries, clothing, household supplies and bedding are appreciated. You can find out how to donate on our website at kait8.com.